Are you ready to ride metal riffs? Then let's get right into it. The first step is a scale choice and for that the Phrygian just works the best. And if you're wondering who or what is Phrygian, then if we take regular C major scale, C, B, E, F, G, A, B, C, then Phrygian is nothing else than starting the same scale but this time from the note E. E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E. But for better playability, we play it going to the right. E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E. And if you take the same scale and play it octave lower, you're going to summon Dave Hetfield or James Mustaine. And if you're on the 7th string, you can play the same exact scale from the above string. And now you're back in the year 2000, or you go even lower and you'll be in 2020. Or just play it from any other fret or string following the same pattern. 1, flat 2, minor 3, 4, 5, flat 6, minor 7, octave, which is just 1, where it all starts again. And horizontally it will be 1, flat 2, minor 3, 4, 5, flat 6, minor 7, and octave. Awesome, so once you have that, then the next step is the choice of technique. This is where you can really start to personalize your sound. Whether you're into downpicking, tapping, hybrid picking, gallops, thumping, or just some palm muted chucks. Each technique adds a unique texture to your riffs, so experiment with different approaches to find what really speaks to your style. What I recommend is not reinventing the wheel, but instead taking inspiration from songs you already like. You can create a playlist or a note where you write down all of your favorite riffs and what you like about them. Whether that's certain sound, technique, BPM, tuning or phrasing, that way, when you're ready to write your own riffs, but you're lacking a bit of an inspiration, you pull up these notes and straight away realize which way you want to go. Because nothing is more important than putting everything into action, which is the last step number three. Here is the thing, it doesn't matter how many steps I provide you with or anything I explain in this video, because the only way how you'll ever stop your practice routine being jumping from one YouTube video to another and instead finally experience the results you want is by implementing what we just went through. That's why I've prepared this simple drum track for you. Literally just take a few minutes to see what you can come up with using the Phrygian mode over one string using down picking the first time around. The second time around you can try using some tapping to see whether you can create something that you like. And the same either for gallops, thumping or even some 16 notes alternate picking. So here is the drum track, get ready, let's have some fun and here we go. Well done, as the only way you'll be able to truly progress is by confronting and overcoming those feelings of self-doubt. That's why it's important to get comfortable working with a certain level of discomfort. As the only way how you'll be able to get better at writing riffs is by writing riffs. There isn't any other way I'm afraid. 
So that's all for this video and if you're ready to finally transform your client on all fronts, then make sure to check out the link in the description. Don't worry, you don't need to hand over your email or watch a 3 hour webinar. None of that, it's just a video of me telling you how I can help you to get there. I'm not planning on sitting here and telling you how this amazing program has already helped so many guitar players. You can check that for yourself in your own time if you feel like you want to. Either way, thank you so much for being here. You're the pure reason why I make these videos. So if you've enjoyed this one and mainly you've learned something, then please let me know by hitting the like button. So I know the stuff I talk about is helping guitar players out there. And if you decide to support this channel by subscribing to it, then that would really make my day and I would just love you for the support you're giving me. So thank you so much for doing that if you want to. Thanks again for being here and I hope you have an amazing day. See you in the next video.